so inside this class we are going to discuss about font properties and inside font properties we have font family so the topic is font family go to your code editor and save us this file by giving the name font hyphen family family dot html and you can save this file change the title css font family font family so here we have just a heading 2 I'm just going to remove this direction property from here because we don't need this inside this class save and you can just launch your web page inside the browser hi and welcome to CSS3 course so uh, you can just use here a line height 70 pixel we have already discussed about this property a refresh so it is in center and you can use a text align to center this text also we have discussed about this center inside text properties section so here hi and welcome to css3 course here is written so you can just increase the font size anything you want you can just do so here inside this topic we are going to discuss about font family so you can just write here font dash family and here you can write any font name like uh, something is called comic sans ms so i know this one you can save this and refresh so you can see the font style or the font family is changed it's totally another font you can write here uh, something like monotype mono type cursiva it's just another font refresh so you can see this another font so you can just type here something like 40 save and refresh so this is just another font and you can find this all font from the on notepad just go to notepad i'm just going to click here on the format and go to font inside font inside font you can just see here here is written font and font style from here you can just select any font and you can just see the preview here for example courier courier news any other font for example dev time so you can see anyone you like you can just copy the name and you can paste inside your editor inside font family now you can save go to your browser and refresh now you can see we have just another font family here so if you want any other font family like df mincho just something like this you can copy this one and paste instead of this current one you can save and refresh so like this you can change but there is another way also that you can just go to google.com and simply you can write here fonts.google.com you can just find some google fonts from here beautiful fonts from google then you can just apply them uh, on your web page so you can see the first one is roboto and this is just a uh, very famous one any one of them for example this one chicle roboto con condensed condensed open sense any one of them just click on this plus sign if you want to just use them and you can just click here inside the embed code you can just copy this link right click and copy after your title tag you can just add this one and save and in another line you can just copy the font family property with the name and you can just use here now you can save go to your web page and refresh so you can see we have totally another font so here is not one font roboto is number one and after that they have given sans serif 
so here if you just remove these roboto ones control x and save now you can come here and refresh so you can see sensitive is another font that they have used here and save once again now we can refresh again this is just on robot so like this you can just uh, apply any of this font from just google for example you want to just use this letter click on the plus icon and here on just a letter this one here you can just click and you can copy the link just paste instead of this one here or you can just add another line here like this and save this just roboto.com i think this is not uh, the that one yes this is just roboto.com so you can just click on this letter and here you can just click on this one once again sorry so you can just copy this link control c and paste here instead of this control v so later you can see this one and copy the phone name from here very easy you can copy and paste instead of font family here save go to your web page and refresh now we have just another font which is totally changed so i hope you are understand how you can change the font family inside css so there is two way the first way that i told you go to uh, notepad go to format and click on the font you can just find some font from here you can just copy the name and use them and the second way just go to fonts.google.com to this website and you can just find just beautiful fonts like this and you can just see the preview here for example uh, for the first one roberto you can just click here how is just the paragraph look on the alphabet like this you can see number you can just check all of this on the custom you can just say on the regular on the board you can see on the medium 500 or you can see on the regular size just like this you can just increase or decrease from here also so you can uh, click on the plus icon just copy the link and copy the font family that i have just already shown you so i hope you have understand how you can change the font family inside css inside next class i'll come back and i will tell you about the font style so till next class just have a nice time and see you